forceps. Forceps. Sponge. Sponge. And he's a goo. Oh, Mr. Shag, is he gonna be okay? I'm afraid he'll never walk again. <gasps> but then he never could. Oh. Don't worry, Artie. He'll be fine once the glue dries. Oh, thanks, Mr. Shag. <laughs> Bite Man is my most favorite action figure in the whole wide world. Mm. Next to the Cosmic Canine, and Mighty Mutt, and Pectoral Pooch, and Wonder Whelp, and Gold of the Retriever, and wow, Funny Rabbit. Wow. It's the Hooded Hound. Oh. <laughs> Speak, boy. Freeze, Fido! Freeze, Fido! Oh, boy, that sure brings back memories. Are you talking to me? Oh, yeah, I'm talking to you. Come on, let's get... Oh. When I was a pup, I'd stay up all night reading Hooded Hound books by flashlight. Gee, Mr. Shag, huh? I didn't know they made Hooded Hound books. Are you kidding? You, you should read one. They're a lot of fun. Read? For fun? <laughs> That's a good one, Mr. Shag. Well, I guess books just can't compete with toys nowadays. Kids these days have pint-sized attention spans. It's all these newfangled games like pinball. Nobody plays pinball anymore, Ace. Eh? <laughs> uh, yes, Hardy. Were you just talking to that poster over there, Mr. Shag? Uh, th 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 this this poster right here? Oh no 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 heck no! I was uh, thinking. I I happen to think out loud a lot. <laughs> sure, Mr. Shag. I gotta go now. Later, animator. Hey, Rembrandt. Try thinking up a new story for me. I'm tired of just hanging around. Hey, how about this for an idea? Ow! A mysterious masked adventurer will make his mark on Dog City. Ha-ha! <laughs> Elliot, I'm a private eye dog. The last place I want to be is surrounded by a bunch of muscle-bound super mutts. Okay, maybe that's the second last place I'd want to be. Stan Flay is now signing autographs in the Fetch the Ballroom. Dog City Comic Book Convention? Elliot, you call this exciting? Where's the action? Where's the danger? Where's the fire? It was a slow day in Dog City. Somehow, I got leashed into accompanying Eddie to the Dog City comic book convention. Oh, boy! Mongrel Comics! They've got the hot dog and his heroes in the known universe, Ace. Like Wiener Dog, the Whippet, and here, boy! Hot dog and his... yeah. What do you say we go to that booth? Kid, there's no line over there. Dog City Comics? No thanks. They're as old as the Watchdog. It's a well-known fact that they're finally gonna put that old character to sleep. The 100 rarest and most valuable comic books are now on display in the Airedale room. To think these pulp periodicals, once thought not even waiting to housebreak oneself upon, are now valuable collectibles. Here is a thought. Let us steal them. <laughs> genius, boss! Dare I say, super genius? Bruiser! Sorry, Uncle Bugsy. I just love the watchdog. He's the bestest. Oh, joy! Oh, gotcha! No dog you'll suspect us in these costumes. We can pull this heist in broad daylight. Uh-oh. I think we just scared the daylight out of here. What, huh? Someone is copped by coveted comics! Stop! Thieves! Bad dogs! That sounded like a cue if I ever heard. Time's up for canine criminals! Don't be alarmed! It is I, the Watchdog! It's him! It's really him! Time to spring my stopwatch on those evil doors! Run for it, boys! Elsie Punch is our collective clocks. Take heart, citizens. Your rare and valuable comic books have been unbagged, so to speak. Thank you. You're too kind. Just doing my job. Oh, stop. It looked like there was a new breed of hero in town, territory previously patrolled by a certain private eye dog. Ah, I detect an assemblage of unsuspecting tourists. A right time. For a senseless hijacking, no doubt. <laughs> All right, no doggy move. We're like hijacking this boss, okay? 
Just think, Ace, the watchdog, right here in our fair city, and we were there to witness the Bark Knight's triumphant return. Time's up for canine criminals. So he saved the bus. Large deal. You'll never see Ace Hot jealous of a dog in <laughs> tights. Yip, yip, hooray! Boy, was I jealous. And I had a good reason to be. X3, X3, Labrador gang on crime spree! Bugsy who? What? Ace who? This is getting personal. You had to wonder about a mud who calls himself a brooding loner, who loves nothing more than wagging his tail in the public eye. I had a pretty strong hunch that the watchdog was up to something slimy. Real slimy. All right, Elliot, what gives? Sorry, Mr. Shag, but what do you think of my Bite Man doghouse ooze chamber catapult playset? Some assembly required. Uh, it's uh, great, Artie, but maybe uh, you should focus your attention on something a little less uh, messy. Like what? Like maybe a book. Hey, cool idea. Thanks, Mr. Shag. Happy reading, Artie. Now, where was I? Wow! It makes a great ramp for my Bright Man dirt bike and detachable sidecar. Battery's not included. Well, if Artie won't check out the origin of a true hero, maybe Ace Hart will. I was determined to expose the watchdog for what he really was, a fraud. I decided to try to unravel this mystery at the source. Bob K-9 was the creator of the watchdog. I had a hunch if any doggy could make sense of this, he could. Mr. Hart, it's every creator's dream to have their creation come to life. Pinocchio, Pinocchio, wherefore art thou Pinocchio? If I, in my work, have inspired one noble soul to risk all for the sake of truth, justice, and the canine way, then I say, Excelsior! Well, gee, uh, thanks, Mr. Canine. This has really been helpful, but uh, I'll be leaving your solar system now. It was my pleasure, Mr. Hart. After my encounter with Canine, I decided to go to the one pooch who'd curb any dog whose tricks weren't by the book. Rosie, we gotta do something about this watchdog. I'm way ahead of you, Ace. We're ready for a test run. Cue the boys on the roof. Keep your eyes on the clock tower. Canine criminals, beware! The long arm of the law is connected to the hands of the watchdog! Hey, too, Rosie. I knew Rosie always did things by the book. I just never thought it'd turn out to be a comic book. It looked like every dog he loved the watchdog, but me. Questions kept gnawing at me like a famished flea. Who was this glory hound? And if he was so perfect, why did he always let the crooks get away? And what kind of mutt comes running at the sound of a bell? Hmm, I just might get my chance to clean this watchdog's clock after all. You rang, Chief? Not the Chief, just a concerned citizen with a question, namely, just who the howl do you think you are? I am the precious sands in the hourglass of society. I am the time that wounds all heals. I am the Watchdog! Nice speech. But will the real watchdog please stand up? Hey, let go. I, I mean, no one must compromise my secret identity. Hey! I'm sorry, citizen, but it's imperative that I maintain the integrity of... <laughs> the watchdog took a licking, but kept on ticking. Well, it was pretty obvious that my final hour was just about up.
The big paw was on the 12, and the little paw was on the 5. And my time was running out. Oh, my dog, I didn't mean to. That wasn't supposed to. Uh, hang on, boy. Uh, stay. Stay. Just as I figured, the watchdog wasn't much of a hero without an audience. Fetch that safety net. Some doggy get a searchlight up there. Oh, great. Look! It's the watchdog! The hour of the watchdog is at hand. Stupid novelty gizmo. Oops. <gasps> Fear not, citizen. I've got you. Yay! All right! Thanks, whoever you are. I guess I owe you one. Sorry, bud, but you're a little too nosy for your own good. Knockout gas. But I hung on long enough to see the Labrador game. They were in cahoots with the watchdog the whole time. Suddenly, all the pieces fit, especially the biggest piece of all. K-9. I think he's coming around. He must have passed out from the excitement. Imagine fighting side by side with a real hero like the Watchdog. What am I, chopped liver and egg? Let me tell you something about your hero, kid. Oh, you don't need to tell me. It's a well-known fact that hero worship is an integral part of a puppy's growth and psychological well-being. It's the very foundation upon which we youngsters build ourselves up into model members of society. So, what do you want to tell me about the Watchdog, Ace? Uh, you took the words right out of my mouth, kid. I didn't have the heart to tell Eddie the truth about the watchdog, but I had to do something before some doggy got hurt. Uh, you sure nobody saw us together? Absolutely. Smile. <gasps> You're on candid canine. Either the watchdog hangs up his cape for good, or Dog City learns the truth about the Bark Knight. No, you can't. The watchdog stands for truth, justice, and the canine way. I couldn't just let them write my creation off to comic hero heaven. <laughs> That's the only reason I staged all this. <laughs> what about all the money you stood to make? Okay, that too. But, Fab, what about tomorrow's gig? What do you say, Hart? <laughs> let the watchdog go up with a bang, not a whimper. But don't do it for me. Do it for all those wet-nosed pups out there. The watchdog is a fake saint! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll do it. For them. So, what's your plan, K-9? K-9? Elliot! Oh, Elliot! Bow wow, Mr. Shag! This is turning into some story! So, so, what's the watchdog's daring rescue gonna be, huh? Uh, I'm working on it, Artie. Oh, oh, oh. Let's see. Uh, oh, listen. We, we could do we could do the runaway train, oh, like yeah, in yeah, yeah. Hound for Glory. Oh boy! Like this, like this. Woo woo! Woo woo! Boom! Or a nail biting dog fight, like in <gasps> Terrier and the Pilots. All like right, this, yeah, like yeah. this. Let's see. Mission <laughs> 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 yeah, 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 yeah. See that? You sure know your action figures, Mr. Shag. Actually, all this came from the Hooded Hound books. Really? Yo, Mr. Ink and Paint, are we any closer to a novel ending? Or am I barking up the wrong tree? Uh, uh, well, uh, yes, well, uh, I'd better get the whole let out. <laughs> It's spectacular! A fitting rescue for the Watchdog's final appearance! The labs hijack a float in tomorrow's Arbor Day Parade. Holding the entire city hostage, then the Bark Knight appears to save the day! At which point the Watchdog fades into the sunset for good. What could go wrong? The Labrador Gang! Everywhere's I thought it's the Labrador Gang! Bad news, boss! A little bird doggy just told me that the Labrador Gang is planning to put the bite on the Arbor Day festivities! A senseless act of violence, and I am not the perpetrator of it? Come on! We got dirty work to do! The Arbor Day Parade. There's something about a holiday honoring trees that brings a lump to a hound's throat. Watchdog to Labrador Gang. Synchronize watches at 1100 hours. Rover. Labrador Gang to Watchdog. We'll hit our mark in like two minutes, 30 seconds. Rover and... <gasps> Look out! 
All right, labs. If it is a war use want, it is a war use will receive. Don't swat, don't swat. Hey, we're just comic book artists, right? Do yous mean to implicate that I have been upstageified by little more than wimpish imposturers? Not only that, but these explosions are as phony as they are. Well then, what say we interject some real senseless violence into the mix? <laughs> Now I can collect the ransom bones and blow up the parade to boot! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, please, please. Welcome, welcome the float from, from the Poodles, Poodles for Peace and, and their and tribute to the great, great Dogwood, Dogwood Farm. Yes. Next, Next, we have the entry from, from the Labrador, Labrador Gang, Gang, who threatened to detonate their explosive rigged Redwood, Redwood float Redwood if they don't receive five million bones in five minutes. <laughs> It's the Vile Gang. Don't worry, Ace. The Watchdog will be here soon. That's what I was worried about. I had to warn Canine before it was... Don't be alarmed. It is I, the Watchdog. Too late. Yeah! Okay, Herschel, curtain time. I'll stop you evil curs with my stopwatch. You are getting sleepy, sleepy. What's with the nut and his party favors? Come on, fellas. No ad living. Sick em, boys! Well, Bugsy and his boys were raining on the watchdog's parade, I decided to make sure our plan went off without a hitch. <laughs> Not a muzzle at bomb. Citizen! Time is on your... I'm just in the nick of time. What could go wrong, Sam? Well, I said I wanted to go out with a bang. Let's find out who's the brains behind the mysterious Labrador gang. Bugsy Vile? But, but, but we, and they, then I, uh, uh, skip it. Watchdog, and once again you've saved our fair city. Let me be the first to shake your paw. Thank you, Mr. Mayor, but I'm afraid the time has come for the Watchdog to wind down and retire. Say it ain't so, Watchdog. But the legacy of the Watchdog will live on as long as heroes like Ace Hart are on the job. Farewell, faithful fans. <gasps> and that was the last time any dog you heard from the Watchdog. Almost the last time. Well, Hart, it's been real. Ditto, canine. Where to from here? Me and the boys are starting our own comic book company. It's high time I created a new hero. I'm thinking a private eye dog. It could work. Where to, Mac? Where to? Where time wounds all heals. Where the precious sands in the hourglass of... <clears throat> Cleveland, please. A most watchable adventure yet, kid. Not bad, if I do say so myself. So, Artie, what do you think? Artie? The night was as sweltering as a chihuahua's breath as the hooded hound made his move, swooping silently out of the night sky, taking the uncurbed dog completely by surprise. Wow. It was over in a flash. Nice the work, Elliot. Bob didn't even Thanks, know Ace. Him. He got whacked before his newspaper cleared the holster. And before he could say, who is that masked mutt, the hooded hound was gone, off on another pressing mission of mercy. The end. <laughs>